Hello, welcome to Oak Business Consultant. Today we are up with another video which is about the blockchain P2P Excel financial model. P2P means peer-to-peer -peer services. Now this blockchain P2P Excel financial model contains peach cells which are input cells. Input cells means the user of this model can change the values themselves and then it will alternatively affect the corresponding model. Next up we have the grey cells which are the formula cells. Then we have the light grey font cells which are helping cells for other cells. Starting with the financial model, firstly we have an important component of the model which is input sheet. Input sheet contains some important assumptions. For example, company start date, operations date, funding assumptions, equity financing, debt financing. Then we have revenue assumptions and the growth of prices. Next up we have cost assumption and its growth. Then we have some other assumptions such as tax rate, subscription period, average transaction amount and rate of subscription renewal. Next up we have the user and marketing assumptions that contains the assumptions regarding customers of first month, leads and etc. Then we have the assumptions regarding leads from different digital marketing platforms such as Facebook, Instagram and YouTube. Next up we have the capital expenditure assumptions and operating expenditure assumptions. Then we have a table which shows the salaries for different kinds of employees. It contains both annual salary, monthly salary and the benefits. Next up we have working capital assumption which contains the inputs regarding account receivable, account payable and inventory days. Moving on we have revenue analysis part. Revenue analysis part contains the number of customers and the segmentation. Now, segmentation means that out of these total customers how much customers are generating from each revenue stream. How much customers are allocated to each revenue stream. Moving on we have the revenue calculation for different revenue streams. Then we have the cost calculation on different revenue, different revenue streams. Moving on we have the marketing budget. Marketing budget uh, contains some customers, then lead, then lead segmentation that how much of our business uh, is generating leads from paid and organic channels. Then we have leads from paid marketing, organic mar mar marketing and leads from different digital marketing platforms such as Google, Facebook and Instagram. Next up we have the digital marketing summary. Moving on to the startup summary we have how much of a business is funded by investors, how much of a business is funded by loans, private funding which is investment from the owner. Next up we have the total expenses which are total variable cost and total fixed cost. Moving on we, in the startup summary we have the summary regarding assets and liabilities and capital. Moving on from the startup summary we have financial statements. Financial statements contain income statement which shows the total revenue, total cost of goods sold, total gross profit and our net income. Next up in financial statements we have the cash flow statement which shows the cash flow from operations, the cash flow from investing activities and cash flow from financing activities. After the cash flow we have at the end the net cash balance. After that we have a balance sheet. Balance sheet contains the summary of total assets and total liabilities. Moving on from the financial statements part we have financial analysis. Financial analysis contains the customer acquisition cost, customer lifetime value analysis, break even analysis, company valuation and sensitivity analysis which shows the actual scenario, optimistic scenario and pessimistic scenario. Next up we have some important KPIs and ratio analysis. Moving on we have the working sheet. Working sheet contains all the working regarding employee payroll, operating expenses, lease schedule, loan schedule, depreciation schedule, 
and the working capital working next up we have dashboard dashboard contains a clear picture of our where business is standing in graphical manner which shows all important graphs so this was about blockchain p2p financial model hope you have enjoyed this video thank you